Welcome to Christmas. If I'm yelling, I cannot hear out of this ear. Another Christmas, another ear infection. So today, I'm gonna be trying to follow a Christmas glam makeup tutorial. Green glitter smoky eye. This is like, if you are going for it. Now, I've never done anything like this, so I thought it'd be fun to try it. It's like glitter, glitter, just heavy. This is by Danit. I don't even want to try to pronounce it because I will get it wrong. He has 2.2 million subs. A macro influencer. I'm following Katy Perry's makeup artist on Instagram and he posted this photo of her and I was like, wow, I want this look on my face too. This is my version of this girl's version of Katy Perry's makeup. Everything always just comes back to Katy Perry, doesn't it? I want all of those sparkles on my face. I wish I could talk like her. She kind of reminds me of Marzia, PewDiePie's wife now. And I'm like, hey y'all. We all fall makeup tutorial. Wow, her makeup looks better than snow on cat's tail. I'm so ready to get my face decorated like a Christmas tree. Oh, love that. This one right here. I'm gonna load my brush with it. I'm using the Sigma E25. Load my brush with it. I'm using the Sigma E25. I don't know what that. Oh, okay. And this is going right into my crease. Why well, she has that like that close up? She's professional, sis. The green color is higher than that. So I'm starting off by placing this color. Okay, that's beautiful. Okay, that's beautiful. Now. Okay. Let's see if I'll say, okay, that's beautiful about mine, will you, I won't. So mine will just be a version of hers, that is a version of Katy Perry's, that is probably a version of someone else's that they didn't credit because apparently no one credits anyone in the beauty community according to T-Spill, the YouTube channel. Take the hallway, bows of highly beautiful. Now I'm gonna mix the shade Fake Tan with Coco. And this is going in my lower crease. Lower crease? There are two creases. Okay, time for the green. Now. <laughs> Not quite yet, sis. Okay. Probably gonna get demonetized for that. <laughs> a demonetized joke. That was a clock. Lower crease. No crib for a bed. Just a transition shade. I don't know if that's what that is. Hers is a lot darker than mine, so I'm gonna make mine darker. This is where we're going down, down. Bro, you want a smoky eye? I'll give you a smoky eye. Oh gosh. When it actually has pigment, so you can't just like rub it all over your face. Okay, time for the green. Now. I just want to make a confession here. Green is my least favorite color. You know what? Green's my favorite color. I wish I could have my wedding dress be emerald green. Does anyone care that I'm saying this? No. It doesn't make me excited. Green gets me so excited. Crims. 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 However, if it's in the form of an eyeshadow, I absolutely love it. Okay, good. It's my and this is going all over my eyelid. <sighs> so I couldn't find like a, what do you call it, metallic green, but I have this NYX palette that has all of these bright colors on it. So this looks exactly like one of the first eyeshadow palettes I had. Imagine me in school just be like, just wearing these colors. Just Oh, there she goes. That sure is green, though. I'm basically just swatching on my eyelids. Okay, there's the green. And I'll diffuse that green shade into the brown crease color. Then 
Her eyelid doesn't do what mine's doing. I have like a definite line of where it ends and then. Now to darken up the outer corner, I'm gonna take this black eyeshadow here. So I'm adding that in the outer V. That's a lot. Black eyeshadow, never done that before. Um, I'm gonna use this Morphe, no number on it because it came in a pack. Oh, now, I've seen enough makeup tutorials to know it looks weird at first, but it'll get better. <laughs> Hello? I usually use this brush for our uh, concealer, so that'll be fun trying to use that tomorrow. And if you're asking, yes, it is a personality trait that I don't wash my brushes. I actually mix these three shades here. Oops, you don't see. <laughs> I'm mixing these three shades. It's okay, girl. It won't help if I do see it. So. Some eyeshadow on. So that it will be way easier to blend out the black shade. Blending black eyeshadow, that can be difficult. So take your time. Can't just leave it like this. Uh, okay. <clears throat> okay. So, okay, these brushes are goners. Send it in. Patience is wearing thin <laughs> Because blending black eyeshadow That can be difficult I'm gonna go get a makeup wipe and try to fix this I should have had the makeup wipes on deck like ready to go but I like went for it But like sometimes going for it Is not the way to go Let's try this again y'all <laughs> Excuse you. Is this the one with black on it? Okay, this is better. This is better. Shadow shield. I have my foundation on and it won't be fun to get green glitter all over my face. I went to Ulta to try to find shadow shields. I asked the girl, see, I hate asking people for help, but I was like, I can't find this anywhere. So I went up to the girl and I was like, do y'all have shadow sh eyeshadow shields? And she was like, um, if we have any, they're over here probably. And we looked and they didn't have any. So I'm sure no one goes to Ulta and is like, do you have shadow shields? But I found these and they're called Line and Defy Eye Tape. I probably should have put this on before I started the eyeshadow. Now that I think of it. And they say elf on them. Good marketing. Okay, that hurt too much. Now I'm gonna take some glitter glue. This is the BH Cosmetics Base Booster. This is going on top of that green eyeshadow. Okay, so we're gonna use this NYX Glitter Primer. Didn't even know that was a thing. Like, look at that. That's gonna be me in a few seconds. It's gonna be me, okay? And after that, it's time for the glitter. So I have some of this glitter. Okay, here we go, ladies. If this is cute, I'll cry. I already feel like I'm gonna cry because of this band-aids on my eye. We'll do the other eye. They always do it off camera. Nah. I'm gonna show the whole experience. It's like, I don't know what every beauty guru is like, I'm gonna go do my brows off camera. I'm like, what are you trying to do? Like hide your secrets from the world? Like why are you doing your eyebrows off camera? Oh, when your hair sticks to the glue instead of the glitter, hey. Me on Christmas morning just like comes out of my room in the morning like this. Now 
taking some of that black eyeshadow from that The Balm palette and I'm applying it very closely to my lashes. You won't be able to do a nice crisp line on top of glitter. It, it's going to be a nightmare. It's going to be a nightmare. So with this black This eyeshadow, is already a nightmare. Guys, what? I love when people text me, guess what? Because you never know what they're gonna say. You know, they could be like, I'm pregnant. Or like, I hate you. It's been an entire hour since I started this. Yeah! go ahead and finish up my face makeup. I'm adding some concealer under my eyes. Okay, so concealer. So I guess I can peel these off. There's all my concealer. There's my beauty blender! Oh, there it is. Now it looks weird! <laughs> okay. What made me think I could do this well? Like, I can't even do winged liners. Oh. I'm mixing these two colors. And I'm gonna smudge that along my lower lashes. Take your mirror, rise it up, and look straight. And then apply your eyeshadows in this area. And look straight. Okay, thank apply you. apply your eyeshadows in this area. It's going to be... You'll be able to see so much more. You'll be able to see what you're doing, actually. Because when you do this, you see nothing. I'm going intense under the eyes today. Okay. Oh no. Yeah, my first instinct is to go like when I'm doing it. I look like I'm in like black swan. Hello, sir. Hello. I'm trying so hard to do it well. Maybe once the whole look goes together, it'll be like. I just added a pair of falsies. These are the house of lashes in the style I lure light. Okay, so she put on falsies, so I'll put on falsies. These are so Oh, I think I need just pop it off. I was watching a video last night, I don't know how I got to it, of people cleaning their lash extensions. They were like, you can get bacteria up in here and you can get infected. I'm like, I'd rather never in my entire life do that. I wonder if like surgeons are not allowed to have coffee before they do a surgery because their hands would be shaking or my hands would be. Now I will tie line my eyes with some black pencil. Like sister has said zilch about mascara. I'm gonna take these two colors and I'll use them to add some definition on my face. Like contouring slash bronzing shade. So we're gonna add some bronze. I'm gonna mix these two blush colors here. And some blush. For highlighter, I'm gonna take the one from that Hourglass palette. And some highlight. <coughs> Time for the glitter lips. First, I'm gonna line my lips. This is a lip pencil by Nabla. Alright, and for lipstick, this is again Nabla, and I'm using their liquid lipstick. Okay, so I'm gonna line my lips with some like $2 lip liner I found. Don't hate it till you trade it! Oh, it smells like hard candy, is that what it's called? That? Yes! Okay. So for the glitter on the lips, I'm grabbing this Smolder Cosmetics Radiant Glitter in the shade Brick. Alright, so we're going to put glitter in the shade TDR30W. Glitter. I'm going to end up with her accent. And I'm going to add that on my lips right after I applied that glitter glue. I feel like my mouth is full of glitter. We're going to put the glue on over this and I'll be disgusted. Time for the glitter. Ooh! 
I can't move my mouth. It's not even focusing on my lips because it's like, no. Uh-uh. Here we go. Bill Hadid. And this completes this look, you guys. I know that it's super bold. Obviously, Katy Perry wore it for some kind of a campaign or something. And I'm aware that you need to be really bold to wear this look outside or to some kind of an event. Thanks all of the attention on your face. And I'm sure that... I don't think so. Hey, if you're wondering what's that bell button right next to the subscribe button, well, if you click it, you'll be notified whenever I post a new video. I want to thank you guys so, so much for watching and hopefully I'll see you in my next one. Bye! Hi, girl. I think I just put too much black on the eyes. I don't know. I don't know what happened. Like, that would be a pose you do with this makeup. But if you're just walking around and you're like, hey, it's not. But you gotta be like, that's what you have to do in this makeup constantly. Don't try this at home. Like, you know how people do really intense stunts and they say don't try this at home. I'm saying don't try this at home because it takes a lot out of you. Oh. Up on the housetop.